ko to? Ito naman, sorry na nga ako sa'yo. Yan, hanggang sorry ka lang naman eh. Iwan. There's no other movie that attempted to do an all-green screen movie. very beginning, the small movie idea, may nakakapit na talaga doon na idea na if if we have one location, maybe we can shoot everything in green screen. Sabi nga namin, explore nga natin to, tingnan natin, let's see if we can shoot this all in green screen. You know, we control the environment, we control the day and night, basically. In the warehouse, you don't have tanot anymore because it's interior. Eh, walang ingay, wala masyadong maraming tao, no delays on the set, di ba? Now, deciding on, be, on doing a green screen is easy. Now, making it happen is another story. The new challenges in shoot, uh, shooting for green screen? Ah, uh, lahat. Unang una, sobrang laki ng scale. Nag-tracker marks kami ng sobrang laking uh, location. Movement. Kasi hindi tayo gumagalaw usually pa green screen. Everyone in the industry, hindi pwedeng gumalaw ng camera. But then, I couldn't sacrifice the storytelling of the movie. We kept on coming back and forth. Wala, wala, pa lang, wala talaga ang solusyon. And then, we got this guy, one guy interested. Si Dave uh, It's always been my motto that we are making film, we're making a story. We should not uh, let technology um, kind of lock us down. Very technical yung setups. Yung sabi sa ni Dave, tsaka nung post-work, kung ano yung kailangan yung gawin. From the start, uh, nalalayan na nila kami. We want to make a film as natural as possible. We want to have the director, uh, we want to give the director the freedom of doing his movie. So um, during the shoot, I was there to just to make sure that um, whatever the director wants, it's feasible in, uh, in post. Now here we are, a group of guys who likes a project and who's willing to spend time and effort to, to make a good job at it. We, we believe in the project. We believe that we have the right concept for it and we're very happy about it. So, moving forward.